This video showcases the manufacturing of the IB LED, available from Tamlite Hilux. The IB LED consists of three separate components, the body, heat shield, and light engine. All materials are laser cut from a 60 inch by 120 inch, 24 gauge galvanized sheet of US source steel. Once the IB LED parts are finished being cut, they are separated and prepared for their next stage of manufacturing. The light engine, which will eventually house LED boards, is bent on an electric brake press, which outputs 50 tons of pressure. Each bend on the IB LED is carefully laid out to ensure an even spread of illumination, as well as minimize light cancellation. After receiving the required number of bends, the light engine is now ready for powder coating. The IB LED body is now ready to be bent into its final form. Now that the IB LED's body and light engine have been bent to the correct specifications, the body and light engine pass through a powder spray booth that applies a minimum 3 mil coating of highly reflecting white powder to both components. Both components will then pass through a 450 degree oven to cure the powder coating. Once all components have been completed, the assembly process can begin. Assembly of the IB LED begins with LED drivers fastened to the body. The number of drivers installed is determined by the lumen package required for the order. Wiring harnesses for connecting to line voltage and for 0 to 10 volt dimming are installed into the fixture and are labeled appropriately. The body, heat shield and light engine are fastened together using special screws designed to ensure continuity between all painted and unpainted components of the fixture. The LED boards are now connected to the LED drivers and the fixture is ready to be tested. Each fixture from the Hilux factory is tested using a high pot tester. The line voltage wires are connected to the high pot tester and a grounding wire leading back to the high pot tester is connected and the fixture and its components are tested. The high pot tester will detect faults within the fixture's components as well as improper grounding once the fixture has passed its test, a testing label will be printed and affixed to the fixture. This label contains the serial code, date tested, as well as the name of the employee who tested the fixture. A UL label is put inside the fixture to further certify the fixture as suitable, and a quick disconnect is added to the line voltage wires. The final step before packaging is adding an access plate with supplied ground screw. Once the access plate and ground screw have been installed, the fixture is wrapped in bubble wrap, placed in a box, labeled, and on its way to one of our valued customers.